New tonight, developers are revealing an ambitious plan to fight the housing crunch on Alameda Island. They want to build over 1,200 bayfront apartments at the South Shore Shopping Center. But, as KPX 5's Andrea Borba reports, it could take decades, and not everybody's thrilled about it. Andrea? In the midst of an ever deepening Bay Area housing crisis, one developer wants to turn this Alameda parking lot and shopping center into more homes. The views of the bay from Robert W. Crown Memorial Beach are worth a million bucks and are currently enjoyed by a car wash. The owner of the South Shore Center, Jamestown Properties, would like to change that with a plan to add up to 1,200 housing units to this part of Alameda. Part of the reason why, call it the Amazon effect. These days that brick and mortar businesses are um, are challenged. These are some of the earliest renderings of the potential housing development. The plans are early on. There is still no environmental impact report. It hasn't hit the Planning Commission, let alone City Council. And at least 15% of the apartments would have to be set aside for affordable housing per Alameda City law. Mayor Marilyn Ezzie Ashcraft would like to see even more. And the other category that I'm interested in is what we call that missing middle. So you have an income that doesn't qualify you for affordable housing, but yet you can't afford the market rate rents either. This isn't a swift moving project with first potential apartments not going up until 2025, full completion in 2045. The retail shops are part of the reason why. There are leases on all the various um, businesses. So Jamestown, I am told, doesn't want to go in and break leases because that's very costly to do, so they will wait until leases are coming up from, for renewal and then just choose not to renew them. Around the shopping center, the worry wasn't about adding more housing, but the congestion problems it would bring to an already clogged Alameda Island, even with another ferry landing and bike bridges coming. Absolutely not enough affordable housing. Um, it just, you have to look at location and how much of a good thing can you fit in a very small amount of space. I just look at congestion. Traffic is already a pain, especially in the Bay Area. Even if it is one bedroom apartments, there's still 1,200 more people on the island. That's a lot of people. For this project to get off the ground, zoning laws in this part of Alameda would have to change. And at this point, the project still does not have a date before the Planning Commission. I'm Andrea Borba. Jamestown will hold outreach events about the proposal on August 1st and September 1st at the shopping center.